channel and thank you so much for joining me and welcome to another grocery haul. This week is Easter weekend, so hopefully you're seeing it on Easter weekend. Um, it's been kind of chaotic. It's also uh, my nine-year-old's birthday. And so, um, yeah, it's been a busy day. We just got home from celebrating for her birthday and we've had lots of festivities, lots of sugar. Um, so if you hear kiddos uh, playing, that's just part of it. But uh, Kroger delivery coming in handy once again this week. I spent 140, I think right at $140 because I had ordered a couple of things that um, like a cake thing, which actually worked out because we got it uh, somewhere else and a pineapple because they were 88 cents, they didn't have. And so they took that off. So I think it was right at $140 that I spent this week. Um, not a bad deal. So let me just flip you around. I'll share with you everything that we got from Kroger this week and um, not a lot here. I did stop in the middle of the week and I got blueberries and strawberries and what else? Blueberries, strawberries, watermelon, cantaloupe, just to kind of replenish fruit. So you don't see that here. Um, and we do still have some frozen veggies, canned veggies, and some other veggies still in the fridge. So that should get us through this week until I go back to the store next week. Um, so let me just flip you around and share with you what I got. All right, so here's everything I got. Oh, here's the first things first. My giant 40 ounce simple modern, simple modern water cup that I already got lipstick on. Um, this came yesterday. I ordered it probably three weeks ago and it took a while to get here, but yes, I was influenced and I finally got one. I'm loving it. I am actually drinking more water because of it. So there's that. <laughs> and then real quick, I also got this from Amazon and it just came in today. So I thought I'd share it with you. It's a four in one milk frother. I have no idea brand if it works great or not, but it does have the four settings. And I got that because I got the Cafe Bustello espresso style K-cups and we're going to try to make sort of our own homemade lattes at home. So I'll check in and let you know how the milk frother works for us, but it froths and steams your milk and it's got the four different settings depending on what you want. Um, so yeah, that was my two different like kind of impulse purchases, but um, sodas were still four for 15. So I got two Coke Zero because I should have gotten more last week. That's what my husband's dr been drinking a lot of. And he's been drinking even some at home instead of just at work. So I wanted to get some more while they were still on sale. I also got myself a Dr. Pepper Zero um, and I got a Pepsi. So I am trying the Dr. Pepper Zero. We're gonna see, I'm a diehard uh, Dr. Pepper fan. Mm. So we shall see how I like that, but um, I'll report back, I'll let you know. I don't know, maybe we'll try it at the end of this video and I'll let you know. Um, anyways, salted caramel, uh, the Tarani syrup. This is the small one and it was like $5.49. So if this works out, I'll try to keep an eye out because I think for like $6.99, you can get the double this size bottles of Tarani syrups at um, like Marshalls and Home Goods and all that. And then I also got the, the Tarani caramel sauce. This one was $5.99 for that. So that was kind of my little splurge, $5.99 for the Cafe Bustello espresso style K-Cups. And it's a 12 count, $3.99 as part of the mega event. No, they were $2.99 um, for the family size chicken and a biscuit crackers because my kids plowed through those last week and my husband really didn't get any. So I got him some more spam. I also got him some more of this. Um, you know, I don't care for that, but he does. So I got him spam. Oh, and if you're wondering about my tablecloth choice today, uh, that's the, the pink unicorns for the birthday girl. Um, so that's also why this video is going up a little bit late. Anyways, um, four count of russet potatoes. This was three, $3.99, I think. So it's like for a dollar a potato. That's not a great price, but I just wanted some larger baking potatoes. So that's what I did. Okay, I think Spam was Spam was three seventy nine. Um, Kroger crinkle cut French fries; those were two ninety nine. And then also for two ninety nine, I had ordered their diced hash brown potatoes. They substituted the Orida brand for the same price. I had also ordered the Kroger brand for a dollar seventy nine of their flaky layer biscuits for my husband's breakfast in the morning, and they gave us the Pillsbury Grands for the same price. 
$3.99 for pimento cheese jalapeno, jalapeno pimento cheese spread for my husband. He's going to take that for work this week for lunch. He also requested some Texas toast bread. We had had some of this a few weeks ago. He really liked it with the pimento cheese, so he's going to take that for work this week for lunch. And that was $2.19 for the half loaf of that. I am, we still have some regular sandwich bread left. Things have been really, really chaotic here. <laughs> There's just a lot to unpack there, even more than our update video. And I don't know exactly how much of that I'll fill y'all in on, but just suffice to say there's been a lot going on here. Not a lot of sleep going on. So um, I am not making homemade bread at the moment, but that's the goal to get back to that. Okay, shredded iceberg lettuce was $2.29. I did get a pound of this boar's head, I think it is. Now, private selection, sliced golden roasted chicken breast. This is like $10.49 for the pound of that. And then I also got iceberg lettuce. Words are leaving my body today. That was $1.99. Okay. I thought I only ordered two of the Simple Truth or two of the Silk Dark Chocolate Almond Milk. They're $2.49 still with that mega event savings where you save a dollar off each item. When you buy five or more participating products, mix and match that store, yada, yada, yada. But I didn't. <laughs> I got three. So that's fine. We'll have extra. And so three of those were $2.49. These are $2.50 for the Simple Truth chocolate almond milk. But um, I had a 60 cent off one e-coupon. So one of them was $1.90. Two Milo's half sweet tea, half lemonade. And those were $3.79 each. Two gallons of whole milk. And those were... I want to say $3.89 or $3.79 each as well. $3.99 for the Danimals yogurt pouches. Butter. Butter was on sale for $2.49 a pound, up to five with the digital coupon. I just went on ahead and got two of the salted and two pounds of the unsalted. And I'll throw those in my freezer. Um, $1.79, $1.99 used to be my stock at price, but we really just don't see that anymore. So that's when on ahead, why I went on ahead and got that. Parmesan cheese, $3.99 for the Simple Truth Organic. Um, this was actually cheaper than just the store brand non-organic. So for the same five ounces. So that's what I did. Got that. $2.79 for the Kroger American Singles. And then you could get up to five of their slices, blocks, or shredded eight ounces of Kroger brand cheese with that digital coupon. Up to five of them for $1.49 each. So I actually did that. I got three cheddar jack, one sharp cheddar shredded, and one block of sharp cheddar. So that's all of our groceries. Like I said, I did get some more fruit delivered um, when I got her birthday cake and cupcakes. Um, so I think that was it though. I don't think there was anything else. I did find some clearance meat at Target as well um, the other day. So I got like clearanced out. Let me flip it around. So I was actually able to get some clearanced out meat at Target the other day. I got two pounds of 85.15 hamburger meat for $3 a package. And I also got, what else did I have? I utilized that coupon off of a grocery purchase. Um, so that should be running through the night. So if I post this on Saturday night, then you should be able to see that there. Um, check your Target there for that deal. I also did the household goods deal because I had a digital, like a gift card. So I did all of that. Um, so be sure to check out your Target Circle stuff for deals. Also, what else did I get when I was at Target? Oh, I did get some bacon that was clearanced out to like $5 a pack for, it's like the Smithfield version of their Applewood smoked really thick cut bacon like the right brand. So I went on ahead and got that. And then I also got something else pork chops for three dollars a package for some of those so they had some good meat markdowns so check your targets for that and while we're sitting here chit-chatting let me grab a dr pepper zero i'll taste it and see what i think and let you know all right so here's our dr pepper zero went on ahead and opened it and let me see what we think here There's definitely still an aftertaste, um, but it might be tolerable. I don't know. Every now and then I'm probably going to still want a regular <laughs> Dr. Pepper Zero or Dr. Pepper, but um, these are pretty good. They're 
they're pretty good. There's, there's definitely still an aftertaste, but they're pretty good. So there's that. All right, so that's everything that I've got for y'all. Um, let me know how you're doing. What are you doing this holiday weekend? And I hope you're doing well. Let me know if you found any awesome deals. And yeah, I will see you in our next video. Until then though, I will see you down in the comments down below. Bye y'all.